quick little bitch. You would think that if it's in the instructions, it says to remove these parts, right? For da 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 da, 81, 82, 83, 93, all the way to 93. So we flip over here and we look. That is the side of this switch that's on the side of the carburetor. And it pushes up and it can tell if you're on the gas pedal or not because it will create a vacuum inside of it. And it pulls this little piston over and sucks the switch up and starts the car. Okay. The kit includes the fucking gasket that goes between this and the carburetor. But because in their infinite wisdom, they don't want to include, I mean, two felt gaskets that big. Two. That's all they needed to include that goes on one end of this piston and the other end of this piston. So when it smacks over and smacks over and it makes an air seal. That, this is separate from the carburetor because it's hanging off the side and it's technically a start switch even though it's fucking vacuum occupied, activated. I'm so fucking mad I can't even. It's vacuum activated by the carburetor. It's part of the carburetor. And if there's a fucking air leak in there on those two gaskets, you're not only going to have a vacuum leak on the carburetor, but your start switch isn't going to fucking work. You stupid other fucking Daytona parts fucking idiot. It even says, remove these parts. So I've removed them, and now I can't fucking put them back because your stupid fucking ass. Step one of reassembly is to fucking put this thing back together. 